All right, good morning. Aaron Scheel here, Operator Training Manager here at Ziegler Caterpillar. Uh, happen to be sitting in the seat of a brand new 323 Next Gen Excavator. And we're going to take just a couple minutes here to talk about 2D grade control. And we'll talk about uh, 2D grade with assist. So, uh, again, coming from the background that I did, I've sat in the seat uh, as an excavator operator for many years, sewer and water. Uh, I've had a chance now to spend some time with this 2D system and boy would I have loved to have this back in the day. And my pipe layers would have loved to have it as well. Um, it's literally a tape measure, a um, grade rod, all that stuff tied into one. All at my fingertips. Um, so we're just going to go through a quick little scenario here of a simple setup and an explanation of what we're, what we're able to do with this machine. So what I've got going on here is over here when we talk about 2D and how simple it is, uh, we're going to just do standalone dig right now. So I'm reaching over to a big X in the ground over here. Obviously, this is a pretty crude uh, deal, but let's say that was a survey hub or a point that uh, we wanted to match, or we knew that was a good grade, right? So um, I can reach over here, set my tooth over the grade. I bring up my grade control menu here. So there's our grade control screen. I can either touch the button or I can just swipe to it. Uh, but let's say we want to make that as our, our uh, benchmark. So what I can use is either the, the, the screen itself here, or I can hit a button and uh, turn, that, turn that grade control on. Let's go to the menu here. You can see our benchmark set. We get our green light or our green on. It's telling us that we're at currently at grade. Okay, so let's say we want to go down two feet from there. Get rid of that tone. We're going to go set two foot cut. And make sure that we're going to minus. You can see it's still saying we're going to go two foot fill right now. We're going to go a two foot minus. Again, give us a nice indicator there. Hit our OK button. Go back to home. See, we've got a gap there. We're reading in the center of our bucket. So if I reach over here now and I want to dig down on the left side of the bar here. We're going to start to see our grade when we get close to grade. It's going to start bringing us down. Take another pass here, get a little bit closer. I get a nice audible tone, okay? So right now I can do a, um, an indicate only. So I'm just using this as an indication to know uh, where my grade is at. I'm in charge of my uh, ability to stay on grade, not go below grade. Again, we're keeping those teeth on grade, okay? So we can add in another layer of this with the next technology that we have. We have what's called grade with assist. So it's one of our auto features. I can tap here. I can go in and turn on grade assist. Put it in the normal mode. What this allows me to do is put the teeth at grade. See there, I have an overcut protection, so I can't push through it. I simply pull in on the stick, and the machine grades for me. All right. So often guys say, "Well, wow, that's the whole thing of the uh, that's the whole my whole job." That's what. What are you taking that away from me? I'll tell you what. At the end of the day, um, if it takes stress and takes time and uh, effort away from you. Um, yeah, it's just one of those things you can learn. It's a, like a tool in a fine craftsman's toolbox that he can use to just to make his job and his production uh, that much better at the end of the day. So again, that's a quick just a quick demo on uh, the 2D grade. Again, what we could do is we could put a slope in that trench. We could do a number of different things there as needed to use that. Uh, also, another thing I want to point out is we have um, the ability to basically uh, measure with this system. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the grade off currently. I'm going to go in here and zero this out. Just for the sake of seeing what's going on here. I'm going to use my button over here to set a benchmark. And then I can measure. Okay, so here's the distance here. So as I bring that bucket towards me, I can tell how far that trench is. 
right? So if I was digging out and needed to make sure I had room for a 10 foot pipe, damn, I would have plenty of room there. So another great feature uh, with that 2D grade.